you had a really, really amazing new year, and I really can't believe it's already 2010 or 2010 or whatever you are going to call it, but um, I had a really, really amazing, fun new year in San Diego, and um, yeah, it was just an all-around great time, but uh, when I was away and over the past couple of days, I got a lot of messages and emails saying that I should do a video on the things that I got for Christmas. And at first I thought it was kind of a weird request, but afterwards I thought, you know, I would probably like to watch those videos if other people were to do them. So I decided I was going to try it. And hopefully you guys like it. Um, I can't say that it was the most exciting Christmas um, of my life, um, partly I'm sure because of the recession, but I still got a lot of fabulous things. Um, nothing too exciting, or, um, but still, I got a lot of really nice things, so I'll show you. So I'm going to start out with um, a shirt that I got. But the clothes that I got were all from Forever 21, so I'm sure a lot of you have shirt, the plain black t-shirt. And then on the shoulders it has these um, really cute, kind of like Michael Jackson-esque, I guess, um, 80s Lady Gaga <laughs> kind of um, shoulder padded sequin things. So that was the, the next thing I got was just um, in my stocking was a little um, body spray by Victoria's Secret, Sexy Little Things in Noir, and it smells really good. It's kind of vanilla-y, but like more sensual vanilla, I guess. Um, it definitely has a vanilla smell, but it's more rom like a romantic-y vanilla smell, maybe a little spicier. Um, then I got these pair of earrings. They're also from Forever 21, and they're just long stoned ones and I'm so picky about my earrings and I don't usually wear things like that. um but I usually only wear studs or hoops like huge hoops when I have my hair down but these I think I might wear these might wear these I think they're really cute though then I got um my friend from Sweden who I miss so much who I um met while I was studying abroad um sent me this cutest bag in the world it's a little long chomp and it has like um what is this, uh, stitched, like, scene of, like, a girl in, like, a New York City type thing flagging a cab down, and she'd wear it, she's wearing her long chomp, and it also says long chomp here, and it's in, like, um, a peachy color, and this is a small little tote, um, I just love it, I love long chomp, I have, like, a lot of the bigger ones, just plain colors, but this one is so cute, and has, I just love this, like, little scene on it, I think it's so adorable, so I'm really happy about this, and I love the size, too, because I only have the really big ones, and this one is just totally practical. So love this. Very cute. Next I got... Oh, I'm excited about this. Um, it is the new Kelly Wurstler book. And she's just a really fabulous designer, um, interior design. Or she um, designed the Viceroy in Santa Monica, the hotel. And her just style in general, the, her interior design tastes are just... Fabulous, absolutely fabulous, and I can't tell you how much I love her and her designs and everything I've read about her and all everything that's been blogged about her. But um, just like I don't know, the pictures in here are just amazing. The book is just full of pictures and full of designs that she's done, and a lot of them are really kind of um, a little much. I think I just if you've ever been to the Viceroy in Santa Monica, that's this is like what this book is um, about, and it's just amazing. Um, haven't really flipped through it yet. My aunt got it for me. But I'm um, so excited too. And it's just an amazing coffee table book. I love beautiful books. Um, and uh, especially like hardcover ones that are just kind of great pieces. Oh my gosh, my hand. I have a little hamster. <laughs> a little dwarf hamster who's spinning on her wheel right now. So she made this. I got from my friend who is a Mary Kay representative. Um, I don't know. I just... I wish you would stop that. Can you hear me? My hamster is making noise in her wheel. Um, she, my friend is Mary Kay representative. Oh, I have to stop my hamster. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back, and I'll show you my hamster. <laughs> Isn't she so cute? Her name is Shashui. Um, it means snow, uh, snowflake in Chinese. So she was making a lot of noise, so I'm going to have to hold her because she will be on her wheel and I'll be able to talk to you guys. So next, um, I was talking about my Mary Kay products. She got me this Satin Hands um, Trio. It's a scrub, 
a before scrub, like um, petroleum gel, uh, the scrub, and then a lotion afterwards. And your hands come out like satin. I'm not even kidding. And it's called Satin Hands. Just love it. So that's what I got from that. And then next I got, this is really cool. This is um, like really interesting and pretty. Sorry, hands go. Um, box, Dior, Christian Dior box. And it's like a leather box inside of it. This. It's Christian Dior Holiday Collection Lip Gloss Quartet, I guess what we call it if it was four. Yeah, quartet. And the camera just went weird. Okay, there it's back. And it looks like this. It's a little satin, black satin compact, I guess, with a really cute little signature D dangle on it. And inside is four colors with a little mirror. Love it. And I also, my phone, sorry. I also got a lip gloss. And this is in number 641. It's really cute, called My Dior. It's just a little book. And um, it's really pretty, and it's like pearlized, like snake skinny on the front. And inside it's just lined infinite paper, but it says Dior on the paper. So how cute is that? If I was still in college, ugh, I would have loved that for taking notes. But what a cute little box, huh? And it came with like the, the lip gloss and a little quartet of lip glosses. It also came with a small little perfume. But I have that in my car. This is a little necklace. And I love um, fused glass things. I don't know if you know what fused glass is. I don't, maybe, I'm, maybe it's the wrong term. But it's just like this pretty glass. And it's just glass that's melted together, I think. And it comes out in these really interesting... Sorry, my hamster is bothering me. Um, in here, um, just got a little cute necklace of an owl, little gold necklace. I got the Miss Dior Cherry, and I was really excited to have gotten this because I've been wanting a brand, a new um, perfume to start out my new year, because um, I'm very like associated with this with smells and things. I think, and so I was really hoping I'd get this, and I did. And this is the big one. It's a hundred milliliter, and I just love the way Dior Sherry smell, Miss Dior Sherry. This is what it looks like outside of the bottle. Honestly, though, I, I love the smell, love it so much, but I really am not happy about the color of the um, perfume itself. It's like orangey peach, and I don't like this color. I think it looks doesn't really match. It should have been like a light pink color, even the clear. But I was really impressed with the fact that, this sounds really weird, but, like, who cares, right? But that the little bow is metal. It's not plastic. I don't know why I like that, but I liked it. And if you haven't smelled it before, I think it has almost like, um, like a, ma a male cologne scent to it. And I really, really like, like the way men's cologne smells. If it was socially acceptable, I would totally wear men's cologne. But it has a slight scent of like what a men's cologne would smell like. It's very spicy. I love it. And it's different than anything else I have, so I'm really excited. So that's that. And um, I think that's... Oh yeah, I also got... Um, I've been looking funny. I've been looking for a Heather Gray, like a very, very light gray, juicy couture tracksuit. I love juicy couture tracksuits. I just like kind of live in them to run errands and things. But I wanted just a gray one with nothing on it. I hate the ones with like diamonds all over them and like those gaudy, like, I don't know juicy girl, juicy ass, or sorry, whatever it's people, I don't like the way those look. Um, and my mom found me a Heather Gray, just plain juicy outfit, Costco. And it was like $100 for both pieces, so it was a great score. So I got a Heather Gray juicy tracksuit too, which I love because I've looking, been looking for it forever. And I think that's pretty much all I got, but I hope you guys liked what I showed you and got to meet my hamster, Chatwe. <laughs> and if you have any other quick requests, please keep on letting me know. And um, thank you. And have a happy new year. And post video responses and subscribe, please, and comment. And um, we'll see you soon. Thanks.